Hey, it's Jason with more insights reporting for 6.5 Media. I did want to talk today about a new preview that's out uh, online. It was just announced called Kiro. Um, it's sponsored by AWS, but it's not an AWS product, which I'll get into in a minute. But the other thing I wanted to point out is that I've been testing this technology for about a month now before the preview. And the thing that stood out with me the most is that it's a vibe based tool, but there's certain elements of it that are really more geared towards enterprise developers. One of which is the idea of spec-based development, which is something that is embedded in Cursor, but AWS kind of takes it to the next level and puts it really at the forefront of the experience. And this is really great because spec-based development is really kind of aligned to how enterprises develop applications in terms of as a team sport. You can load a lot of diverse set of artifacts into the spec to build out a robust spec for the application. Um, multiple people can sit in and iterate it, write it, change it, um, and make it better. And, and quite frankly, it's a good way to uh, use the tool for reviews. So much of what we see with Vibe coding is really built around prompts, but the truth is this spec concept is extremely powerful. The second bit of this is the fact that, yes, it is a tool sponsored by AWS, but it's not an AWS specific tool. Um, you can use multiple authentication mechanisms to log into it and begin to code. It is based upon VS Code, so there's a million plugins out there, including plugins for AWS if you are an AWS customer, but it's meant to be holistic and multi-cloud. I think over the years, AWS has figured out that to gain mass adoption for a developer tool, you really need to not have it be locked into a specific infrastructure. It needs to be hybrid, it needs to be holistic. All the most successful ones have done that over history. And I really think it's great that AWS realized this and is really pursuing this kind of different path, uh, which is a new thing for them. Uh, I'm excited to see how it goes and uh, I'm excited to keep following this technology. I think it's uh, pretty powerful stuff.